So in this I'll be showing you uh, the best graphics setting for mid and low end devices in if uh, for the eFootball 2026 mobile game. So uh, a lot of users is facing issue and uh, with the high graphics setting the game is shuttering, freezing or if you are getting lagging issue. In this video I'll be showing you the best graphics setting. So once you enter into the game the first thing we need to do is simply go to the extra. Select the extra from the top menu then go to the game settings. Here in the game setting you need to go to the graphics and in the graphics you need to change the player graphics to uh, standard or lowest so uh, the lowest will be good if your mobile is low end so you need to select the graphic setting to the lowest next you need to uh, go to the stadium graphics and also this as well to the lowest so the graphic quality will be still good it's not that bad and uh, the gameplay will uh, you will be able to get a very smoothly gameplay and uh, you will be able to enjoy the game if you select the lowest uh, the standard is also good uh, you'll be able to get uh, some high uh, graphic setting inside the game but uh, it's also caused the same issue if your device is not that much high specification so you need to select the lowest graphic setting in here as well and in the frame rate you need to select 30 fps so if you have select 60 you need to go to the 30 press on the done button so it's the first thing you need to do uh, if uh, you want the best graphic setting in the game next you need to go to the download data so if there is currently any downloading started or uh, if you have downloaded a commentary language more than one so for example if you have downloaded english french uh, italian and all this type of uh, different languages you need to delete that you need to uh, make sure that you have downloaded only one language that you want to play in the background so if you have downloaded a lot of language it can also cause this type of issue and uh, if uh, your device is a very low end and uh, then in this case you can uh, also delete the commentary as well because it also used a lot of uh, RAM memory so you need to delete the commentary as well on your device and then try again next in the audio section you need to uh, lower the stadium audio uh, you can uh, lower that as well and also turn off the background music as well in the game and then uh, go to the play settings so uh, here in the play, uh, play setting you need to select the control type is to virtual and paid and uh, if your device is low end then go to the touch and flick you need to turn off the virtual pad as well and uh, in the directional stick type you need to select fixed you don't need to select the move wall you need to select the fixed directional stick type and then press on the done button then uh, next you need to go to in here and defending control type you need to select uh, pressure and style in here and uh, in the button opacity you need to decrease the button opacity as well uh, scroll to the bottom and uh, here you need to turn off the display radar so if you have uh, enabled this option you need to turn off it and also uh, turn off all this option like the showing player name and uh, opponent player name and all this type of setting so you need to turn off this and also the attack and defense level so you need to turn off this and uh, next player indicator uh, so you need to turn off that and then start the game again and uh, you'll be get a lot of improvement inside the game you'll be able to see it so uh, these are some of the best thing to do uh, to fix or to get a best graphic setting inside a football 2026 mobile game also one last thing if you have uh, running a lot of background apps on your device then you need to turn off it and uh, also make sure to uh, open that game turbo and then press on the start button so here you can see uh, you will be able to it's currently get a balance if you want you can change uh, to performance and you will be able to get like 50 up to 50 fps inside the game uh, but uh, this is how you'll be able to uh, get a best graphics setting in a football 2025 mobile uh, 26 mobile game I hope this will help you and if you have any other question leave a comment below see you in the next video